and we're back to learning Premiere Pro and this time I'm going to show you how to create a directional blur transition. It's easy to do, all we need is two clips, you'll find these via description below. And let us just type in directional blur into our effects menu to find it. And under video effects blur and sharpen you should find it, just drag and drop it two times, so, so once for each of these video elements. Or we need the effect controls, if you can't see that go to window, there's also the effect. So let's start with the first clip on the left. Right here is the cut. And if we add a blur, so let's play around with the blur length, 1 on 20 should be fine. Let's see what it does. I'll start the animation by clicking on this clock icon. I want to set the direction to 90. You could also use 270. That makes it horizontal and at 0, 180 it's vertical. So in this case there is horizontal movement, so I want to have 90 or 270, which is basically the same effect here. Then go backwards a little bit, like a handful of frames or 10 frames, and set the blur length to zero. A new keyframe is automatically generated. Now let's get to the clip on the right hand side. So the second one will go to its starting position, so where the cut is. Start the animation, make it 120 for the blur length, and we'll go to 90 once more. Afterwards, go forward, set the blur length to zero. Well, let me roll the clip. So the one blurs out, and the other, it starts blurry and then gets sharp. You can adjust the speed of this blur by simply rearranging these keyframes. So if you widen the gap, it is much slower now. And if you close this gap, you can make it faster. And this is how you can create such a simple blur transition in Premiere Pro. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.